the long walk hurdle is next then this is a three mile one furlong grade one a big race this and a big field for it as well with one or two newcomers just to make things a little bit confusing so the top one then is a fleet lip for james shea bell cannon for alex cherry chalk morning for ryan costello Eaton mess ryan Tamasevi, hazel rig hawker for darren thompson jumping jack flash paul rhodes living the moment david hooley redwood edition david robertson splish splash joshua sutherland sports visa james shea time capsule leon van rinsberg west by rush martin Lidham, climbing shadows craig beckwith cloud mambo craig and lady tinkerbell jim murray lexington rich and natramont castle for the Gerard Raphael and Milet for Craig Allen, sauce it up Ryan Tamaselli, scorched earth Leon Van Rensburg, sharp right David Robertson, stay alert David Hooley and world on fire Joshua Sutherland, so 23 then and away they go and 23 of them and a three mile one furlong hurdle as they get to the first of those flights and there's 14 to take it all and I'm guessing there might be a big golfing class with some of these, I don't think there's a three mile hurdle handicap this week or well, it might be a lower graded one so they get to number two or it could be a maiden of course couldn't it um and so i think quite a few of these horses in this race have probably got absolutely no right really to be running a grade one they would normally i think be in a handicap but uh, they have nowhere else they go but anyway living the moments in the leaders they come down to number three which they're all safely over almost like a hurdling grand national isn't it was living the moment in front then from jumping jack flash in second you can see the vinny gerard pair racing together lexington rich and natural mont castle bell kennan and the orange sleeves also close we've got three in the purple jacket the leader is living the moment for david hooley the second place purple jacketed horse is west by rush that's running in my old colors from a few years ago and the third one is stay alert that's the second of david hooley's runners and towards the back of the field a fleet lipped He's out of shot, but he's just the back marker. As they get down to number four, which they're all safely over. And a fleet lip, I think, must be somewhere adrift because you can see Raphael and Milet, the last one in shot, and there's a fair bit of grass between the back of Raphael and Milet's tail on the end of the screen. So I'm not sure if something's afoot with the top one as they come down to the fifth. And they're all safely over that one as well, with Living the Moment now being joined by. Jumping Jack Flash there, about three lengths clear of Nathramont Castle is a clear third. Splish Splash is fourth, and then Stay Alert is after that one. And then Bell Kennan, West by Rush, is next. The Greys, Hazel Rig Hawker, Redwood Edition on the near side. The Leon Van Rensburg pair are running together. Scorched Earth and Time Capture widest on the track at the moment is Jim Murray's Mount Lady Tinkerbell. And a Fleet Lipped is still well out of shot. So they're coming down towards Flight 6 then. And over it they all go with living the moment leading by the best part of a length just a tail short of a length in the lead with jumping jack flash second and a three length gap to stay alert and that to Mont castle with west wire rush on the inside of them as they take number seven that'll be the last next time round and it's the midway point in the jumping and jumping jack flash might have just about poked his head in front for a few strides there but living the moment likes to lead and He's back in front again as they pass the stand and prepare to swing right handed once they've passed this wooden post. And living the moment is in front from jumping jack flash in second. And then in third place is Nat Tromont Castle, then Stay Alert and West Wire Rush, and then Splish Splash and the Grey Hazel Rig Hawker. Then Bell Kennan, Scorched Earth is next, then Lexington Rich and Time Capsule, Sports Visa and Saucy Up towards the back lady tinkerbell is the back marker in shot and if we get a wide enough angle on them we might see where a fleet lipped is and i've got a feeling that he might be somewhere adrift but it's living the moment it's half a length of the good from jumping jack flash in second they come down to number eight and they all jump that one really well with cloud mambo and rafael and let the two craig allen horses at the back of the main pack now it's quite safe to say we can forget about a fleet lipped but it's living the moment and jumping jack flash over the nights together and that time jumping jack flash jumped it better and has gone a neck up on living the moment second that Tromont castle is back in third west by rushes fourth then stay alert and splish splash hazel rig hawker and bell kennan leading pair then they come to number 10 and that time it was living the moment that jumped it better and regained the lead so they're having a ding dong battle these pair for the lead they've still got a mile to go though and it's living the moment on the inside 
from Jumping Jack Flash on the outside, Gap of Three, then the Splish Splash, then Stay Alert, Nat Thromont Castle, and Hazel Rig Hawker, Bell Kennan, Westpire Rush is still there on the inside. The Van Rensburg pair are getting closer. Scorched Earth and Time Capsule, then Sports Visa and Sauce It Up, and Redwood Edition, and then World on Fire. Chalk on Mourner is in the middle of the pack. Then Raphael and Milet's trying to get a bit closer with Lady Tinkerbell and Sharp. Right, Eaton Mess has been right out the back most of the way. So two's climbing shadows as they get over the 11th. And Living the Moment has gone too clear again now from Jumping Jack Flash in second Splish Splash and Nat Thromont Castle Hazel Rick Hawker and Bell Kennan then Stay Alert Westmore Rush has dropped right out of it but it's Living the Moment who's in the lead by a couple of lengths to Jumping Jack Flash in second this is a third from home good jump again by the leader and he's still too clear but Hazel Rick Hawker now looks the big danger on the outside Saucy Dup's trying to get into it as well so is Nat Thromont Castle running a big race on debut and Time Capsule is cutting through the pack as well Hazel Rick Hawker it's the front with two to jump it's Hazel Rick Hawker who's now suddenly shot too clear but is immediately being chased by Time Capsule Living in the moment dropping back to third then Sports Visa and Redwood Edition Splish Splash is next but it's Hazel Rig Hawker in front Hazel Rig Hawker with two flights to take Hazel Rig Hawker coming down towards the second last the Greys in the lead we see one pulled up at the back Lady Tinkerbell over that one they go and it's Hazel Rig Hawker in front Hazel Rig Hawker from Time Capsule Living in the moment's now beaten in third Splish Splash is trying to run on so is World on Fire they're coming down towards the final flight then now Hazel Rig Hawker and Time Capsule these two are clear it's surely between these at the final flight it's Hazel Rig Hawker on the inside but a better jump by Time Capsule and Time Capsule goes on it's Time Capsule then into the final for the long and Time Capsule is beginning to pull away it's Time Capsule then by two finishing really fast he's scorched earth but racing up towards the line it's got to be another one for Van Rensburg it's Time Capsule that's going to take it Time Capsule is the winner a very fast finishing Redwood Edition was second Raphael and Marlette from the back was third and not sure what's happened to a fleet lip. Oh, there he is. So he did get round and for some reason ran all the way around a distance behind the rest of them. You can see him in the distance there. Lady Tinkerbell pulled up in the straight, so something probably a miss with that one. But Time Capsule throws down the gauntlet for the world hurdle with a pretty comfortable win in the end. And Time Capsule takes it for Leon Van Rensburg. Redwood Edition for David Rawson running on really well at the end was second. Splish Splash for Joshua Sutton there again in third. Raphael and Marlette, another one that ran on well in fourth for Craig Allen. And Scorched Earth for Leon Van Rensburg was fifth.